Not even a week after Marc-Andre Fleury broke his record and moved into second place on the all-time goalie list for wins, Patrick Waugh is back in the NHL. Well, he's back in the NHL, but he's not coming back for his record. He's instead the new head coach of the New York Islanders as he's relieved Lane Lambert as last night's loss to the Blackhawks was seemingly the final straw. Waugh is coming back from coaching the Quebec Ramparts basically since 2005, besides for his three years in charge of Colorado and when he took a couple of years off. It must have been Brandon and I congratulating him and shaking his hand after beating the Mooseheads, that made him realize he needed to get back in the NHL, and now he finally is. He did not want to deal with these bum-ass social media guys anymore. The Colorado fans will be the first to warn you of him. He was great in the first year, even winning Coach of the Year in 2013-2014, but everything went downhill after that first year and losing in Game 7 of Round 1 of the playoffs. They went from 52 wins in that year 1 to 39 the next year, failed to make the playoffs in the subsequent two years, and there were some really wild antics by Wall during this time as he would pull the goalie sometimes with like 10 minutes left if they were losing by three goals and then ultimately he'd step away from the team before the fourth season started and after a couple of years off he went back to coaching in Quebec. The one thing that always remained true no matter where he coached was how much of a players coach he is. The players on the ramparts adore him but now after speculation over the whole offseason after winning last year's Memorial Cup a lot of people assumed he would move back to the NHL and now he's there with the Islanders who let's be honest could really use the shakeup. The Islanders have played in 16 overtime games so far this year and in that span they've gone 5 and 11. That's not good. Even the Leafs who have also played 16 are at least 500 at 8 and 8. And I can't say here and say the Islanders fans have nothing to worry about and that Waugh will right the ship. He very well could but as always Patty Waugh is a bit of a wild card. Probably the only thing I can say for sure is that if you thought the Islanders were boring before this well they definitely aren't now. But what do you think of the legend Patrick Waugh? Could he take over behind the bench and bring the Isles back to the promised land? Let us know your thoughts down below.